Hi, this is Malini. Today I'm going to show you um, pretty rosette-shaped Echeverias. They're from Mexico. Uh, this one is an Echeveri hybrid Chaviana pink. And they have these pretty pinkish lavender um, edges here on bluish gray leaves. And um, they do really well in filter light or they can take full sun as long as you water them. Again, more sun exposure and less water will make these colors more intense. You can see this nice um, crinkled leaves. And then you can pair them with other rosette shape and make a nice, beautiful um, succulent garden with just using Echeverias. This one is an Echeveria raindrops. You can see those little bumps there. Those are kind of resemble uh, little drops, like raindrops on the leaves. And then again, they have pretty pinkish edges here that comes from being exposed to lots of sun, less water. You also have offsets that you can um, propagate and um, grow in other containers. So you have lots of offsets that usually come at the base here. And Echeveras have um, flowers on these tall stalks. See, they usually come on these tall stalks. Here, these are already um, bloomed, and so you can cut these all the way down as, long, as, as far as you can see cut the stem all the way down and then it'll should bloom again for you. This one is an Echeveria Conte. Um, it's a hybrid. It's Echeveria Conte. Here's the scientific name. Echeveria Conte X Imbricata, also from Mexico. And they also have these, this is a more of a bluish gray, almost um, white um, mix with all these different colors. But then you see all these little pink um, edges here, also caused by the sun. So you can put these in filter light outdoors or they could take full sun as long as you water them um, thoroughly. Um, you might water them once or twice a week in the summer and then reduce the watering in the winter time. Thank you for watching.